Hey, how's it going everyone? This is Fixer Med, and in today's video, I'm going to be showing you how to connect the Nintendo Joy-Con to the iOS version of the Anki mobile app. Now, for the sake of this tutorial, you're just going to need the Anki mobile app, which costs about $25.99 on iOS and is free on An Anki Droid. And you're going to need the iOS device, obviously. You're going to need a stable internet connection, and you're going to have to ensure that you can attain a stable Bluetooth connection. So let's go ahead and get started. Let's open up our Bluetooth settings and between the SL and ZR button or SR button, go ahead and hit the sync button and your Joy-Con should pop up. Go ahead and hit on the Joy-Con and it should go ahead and connect to your iOS device. Bam, it's connected. So now I'm gonna go ahead and open my Anki app, hit the gear icon for my settings, hit the review tab, hit game pads. And this is the mapping I use for my gamepad on iOS devices. Very short, sweet, and simple to the point. It automatically works with my 8-bit Do controller as well. You can also use uh, two Joy-Cons, but I like using one since it's more convenient that way for me. So these are the controls I utilize. Going back, I'm gonna go ahead and test out the Anki cards to see if the controller actually works. And as you can see, it is working. Not tapping on the screen or anything, just hitting buttons on my controller. Gonna go ahead one more time back to the gamepad section. Uh, there's more options you can choose to map to this controller, but I like keeping it nice and simple with my controls. As you can see, there's other options like browse, berry, note, flag, top bar, tools overlay, etc. You guys can play around with that if you want. Find the setup that works for you and ensure that you have a comfortable review experience using Anki Mobile. Well, guys, I hope you have a good experience with this. And I hope you also have a good day. So this is Fixer Med signing off. Goodbye and good luck, everyone.